fair, they changed the way you pick things up as well. I'm sure it used to be E that you used to hit. Didn't think. Worth the chat, try. This is uh this is intended to be a multiplayer game. Um I just happened to up in Singular. Um I may at a later date um like hop on a server and because uh, we're never really gonna use the uh the claim system or there's a there's a whole government system. Um so you can run for office. Um, a lot of this is tied into a web browser. So, like when I clicked uh, "run for office," it opened up a web page, and you can basically you can run for office. You can propose new laws, and um, laws are then enforced on the server. It's actually a pretty cool system, but obviously. We're the only people here, so um, like the laws aren't really going to be that effective. Only so I may hop on a server uh, later on once we've kind of gotten to grips with everything. Just to show the the sort of government side of things. That tree has a lot of logs in it. Well, fifty three percent of resources, twenty percent of the time. 60 minutes left. Actually, cost you any calories just to swing the axe around wildly like this? Only if it actually hits something. Eventually we can make things like carts and roads. This will become a lot easier to do than running around, but at this stage it's still very much a, a manual process. So I wish there was um, a command that we or a setting because like literally the only settings I got were create a new world, yes or no. But I wish there was a setting that said, you know, I want skill points to be increased by five thousand percent. Not quite that excessive, but. Although to be fair, getting like 512 skill points a day is uh, actually really good. I'm sure the highest that I got to on a server was something like 300. I 
mixed. Oh, that's cool. Don't know, actually, what about that? Uh, Garage base. Where is basic crafting? What is it in here? That basic crafting bag. Shovel, tallow candle, arrows, bows, scythes, and holes, stone hammer, stone. sooner rather than later. Look, a little tree is grown. In the process of growing. So we are now full, and we are getting 706 skill points per day, which is actually really good. Uh, you want Let's That will mean that when we cook our next batch, take a lot less. It might only take uh, two tomatoes per recipe instead of three, and it will take less time to do to cook it in, which is always helpful. Generally, the the efficiency. Upgrades are probably the most important one in our game. At least in my opinion. I need to figure out how you farm. I want to I think we probably want to get into farming plants can die. I think you're supposed to shovel them uh, to get rid of dead plants, but I don't know. Yeah. Shovel them to get rid of them.
The reason I'm using charred tomatoes, by the way, is because it gives you... It's a roughly even split of everything. I mean, yeah, you've got half as much fat as you have carbs, so you're always going to have an imbalance there, but it, it's pretty close for a beginner food. And I'm sure it was the only... Well, I mean, it probably wasn't the only one of the beginner foods that did that, but... Like, tomatoes are pretty much on our doorstep, so it's going to be pretty simple to go out and gather a bunch. Five long. So because, like... Because this area is really good for tomatoes, we'll be pretty good getting them going forward. I mean, we've got like 58 tomatoes just from that wander around. Uh, for some reason. them should be fine. The, the start of this game is very repetitive, very... Um, it does... It sort of gets easier. <laughs> It gets easier once you get more skill points and you start investing more into like the efficiency skills. This game gets an awful lot easier. Then instead of requiring like a ton of stuff, um, require maybe like one or two per craft. Um, and instead of it taking like twenty minutes. It maybe takes like five. I'm also going to queue. Right about was like an even better way. Campfire creations. Yeah. I haven't even searched that, so there's that's not going to be anytime soon. So we're going to be living off charred tomatoes for quite some time. Uh, so 50 divided by 2 is what? 25 plus 4, 29. Yeah, that's going to take 43 minutes. But again, as we start investing in uh, efficiency upgrades, that's going to go down quite substantially. Like instead of taking, we made what, 29 those at 43 minutes. So each one's what, just under two minutes. So it might go down.